Hello guys, welcome or welcome back to Beatrice Beads and Strings. And in today's video, I will be teaching you the basic knots when making string bracelets. So here I have two random colors. I chose this green and this pink. And I will be showing you guys the most common knots in bracelet making. Um, so let's so get The first started. knot that we will be making is called the forward knot. Now this is the easiest knot, I would say, when bracelet making. So you're going to take your string on the left. You are going to pick up really both of the strings and you're going to put your thumb. So I like to hold this one in a thumbs up position like this. And then I like to stick my thumb up, cross it over so it looks like a four now, I'm going to hold it with these two fingers, my thumb and my middle finger of my right hand, and I'm going to stick my finger through under the green, and I'm going to pull it up. What I've seen a lot of people do is they just stick it up and grab it, and then you're going to pull that up nice and tight, and you're going to do that motion a second time. And there you go, you have completed your forward knot. And just knot. a reminder, if you ever do not understand a knot, you can always um, replay the video, or you can let me know in the comments and I can always redo the video and try and make it with a little bit more explanation now, if I can. Now, onto the backwards knot. This one is also very simple and you use this one a lot in bracelet making. So what we're going to do is I'm going to take my rightmost string and I'm going to do basically the same thing except backwards. So I'm going to grab my leftmost string and my rightmost string, going to hold this in my right hand, my green string, and I'm going to make that thumbs up again. I'm gonna do this a little higher so you can see. So I'm literally just making a thumbs up and I'm going to use my thumb to create that backwards for this time. I'm going to stick my finger under like this, grab and pull. And I will do that a second time to complete my forwards knot. So I'm going to make a backwards four stick my finger under, grab it, and I pull it out, and there we go. Now we have completed our backwards All right, knot. Now that our backward knot is completed, now we're going to get into the trickier knots, I'd say, of these four basic knots. First off, we have the forward backward knot, and it is exactly how it sounds. You do the first half of a forward knot, and then the other half is the first half of a backward knot. Okay, so to complete your forward backward knot, I'm going to take my leftmost string and do the same thing. Make a thumb, cross it over so it looks like a four, stick my, fi oops. Stick my finger in, go around the green string and pull it. Now I'm going to take my green string again, make a four that's backwards, bring it under and pull once again. Now you have just completed your forwards backwards knot. It is super simple to do as long as you know how to do a forward knot and know how to do a backward knot. Okay, so our last basic knot that we will be reviewing today is a backward forward knot. And again, it is exactly how it sounds. It's basically just the opposite of a forward backward knot. Okay, so you're going to take our rightmost string and again, you're going to make that thumbs up, cross it over put our finger in, 
Oopsies. It came undone from the tape. If that ever happens, just put it back in and make sure it's pressed down really nicely. All right. So we're going to make our thumbs up, cross it over, put our finger down and up. Now that is our first half of our backward forward knot. Now we are still going with our pink string, even though now it is on the left. We are going to again make our four, put our finger under the green and pull it up. I hope you guys were able to get these four basic knots in the world of string bracelet making. And if you didn't or have any questions, please let me know in the comments and I will try my best to help you.